Hey guys, this is Mountain Blade Warband. Um, for you, those of you who don't know, it is literally um, you are put in the shoes of a mercenary, I think at the start, or an adventurer, that's it. Um, if you guys want to read this, just pause it, I'm just going to go through it because I've been through this like 50 times. But um, anyway, what literally it is, is that you put in the shoes of an adventurer and you get an army and you can literally go to wherever the hell you, whichever way you want. You can either stay and have like a small group of people and be like a bandit or you could um, go realistic um, or you can have a massive army and um, make your own kingdom. You know, it's, it's great. I love it. Um, but yeah, it, the, a lot of people I've seen don't really like it. I don't know why. Because, like, if you like, love the whole, um, like, sword and shield fighting thing, like, there's no m magic or anything, there's no monsters, it's just literally, like, medieval times, as if you're actually in there. And, I don't know, I just love that for some reason. I just find it so good. And, um, yeah, I don't know, I just love playing this game. It's so relaxing. And, um, yeah. So I thought I would make a let's play, let's play of it. Because, um... Yeah, well, it's bloody awesome. So, um, hmm. I think I put a bit in the throwing, even though it's a really bad thing to have, but I think I'll start off with thro th 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 throwing weapons. Um, I'm not gonna get, oh god. I'm not gonna get too detailed about this, so, um. Yeah. Go to the look I always go for. Man, it's so sensitive, this thing. You like slightly tap it and it goes all over the freaking place. Um, come on, where is it? Oh, there we go. Back there. Okay, um, get a bit of age in there. I don't know, I like definition, so wrinkles and black hair. And I'm not gonna screw around with all of them because I can be there for hours. Um, I'm just gonna pick random here, so I've joined. What does it say? Nord. Okay, well I'm going to start going over the Nords now. So, um, yeah. Oh, I like the Nords anyway. They're not that bad. And what the hell am I fighting? Come here. Now, I have played this game, so I do have a bit of experience. So I know how to shoot an arrow in the general direction of a guy without terribly missing and I know how to block pretty well too so come on come on oh wait he's the guy I gotta talk to you. <laughs> yeah it's a good greeting hello axe to the face anyway um yeah go into his house um okay huh um do, 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 do. Bandits, love violence, uh, brother, taken, pay money, that's literally the gist of it, but um, okay, yeah, I know, I know, I'm a little freaking new at this, anyway, um, uh, damn, what was it, is that, no, wrong ones, resume traveling notes, that's it, um, so I gotta recruit, um, okay, so for those of you who haven't played this game, you to get an army or a small group of men, you got to go to towns. So these little villages, not castles. These are castles. Just I'll stop it here. So these are castles here. They're literally um, used to take control over an area. So I'm guessing this one, this castle will control this village and this village. Now if I take that over, so like say if I'm color red, okay, if I take that over. That, that, and that will turn red riding, which means it's my territory, which would mean I'm Swadian. So that means I just came into the Nord territory and just taken that. Same thing with these. These are cities. Now, they are literally ten times stronger than these because they can house bigger people. And they're usually um, home to the kings and um, more lords come to protect it. 
So they are hard to get, but then they have a wider area. No, I don't want to walk there. But um, anyway, the only thing you can do with the towns is recruit and loot them. Or you can, um, later on when you get a, a thief, I think it's pronounced, um, you can collect tax off them. Because it's your own thief, so it's literally, you just collect rent. And um, you can help them and all that. So, seven soldiers. So they're not really expensive, and they're not really good to start off with. So I generally get um, a fair few, because believe me, they will die really quickly if they're just recruits. But when they get higher levels, then eventually they'll become into Huskiles and um, Veteran Archers or whatever. And then they start to become really good. But um, that's not into a hell of a lot of fighting, I can, t I can tell you that right now. But um, anyway, so collect five men. Um, okay, so I've got to go back to Sargoth, and I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't know how to pronounce most of these things, so if I say it wrong, don't get up me, and there's some looters. Um, so literally, this is me on the horse, and... Oh! Oh! I thought they said free, not freaking... Oh, God. Okay, well, prepare for a bloodbath, guys. So, um... Yeah, this probably isn't going to go as well as I thought. Hope I remember the control still. Charge the enemy. Um, hold. Um. Two? Oh, that's everyone. I don't even think I have archers. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go over there and start wailing on these people before they, you know, get molested. So I can at least take some of them down. I think I've got good heart, horse archery. And these are looters anyway, so they're not really strong anyway. Oh, I don't have good arch. Um, horse archery. Yeah, keep throwing your freaking rocks. You can't do anything to me. <laughs> anyway, um, slowly weakening them. That it's gonna be a bitch when I run out of arrows, and there was a bit of a lag right there. Come on, kill someone. How did I miss it? Oh, there we go. One guy down. Like, oh, there's another. Uh, hit one to kill him. Missed that one. Um. Oh, what's with the lag, man? Oh. Yeah, go away. So, pit in my horse. And me. Um, yeah, these are generally the best enemies to fight, looters. Um, but when you get closer to the sea, um, you get sea raiders, and they are literally the worst thing you can face with a small army. Okay. Let's start hacking and slashing. Hacking and slashing. Um, if I literally get off my horse, I will just be swarmed, so that's why I'm not. Like, generally I would if there's a smaller group of men, but there isn't, and he's throwing rocks at me, and I do not like it. But, um, yeah, that's... yeah. Otherwise I would have been down there just, like, taking them all on, which I probably would die at the end of it, but anyway. Oh god. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Be down. Down. Um, soon I'll send my men in, but um, you know they are, as I said, they are recruits. And why am I lagging so much? Ah, he's um retreating. This guy, I think. Oh, lag again. Yeah, when they retreat, they just run, but because you know they're pussies. Um, and that gets annoying because then they can, especially if they are like soldiers, like a king soldiers or whatever, because then they can come back. But um, yeah, and also you don't get as much experience if they route. That's it, route. But, um, yeah. I might send some of my guys in so they can, um, get a bit of experience before I head them all off. And I think one of them is routing. I think all of them are routing. No, just that one. Come on. No, wait. Yeah, he's following me. He's charging in. Okay, I'm getting off my eye holes here. I'm going in at these bastards. Come on. <laughs> so can he actually do something? Come on. I'm giving it to you. Hit him. Hit him. Jesus Christ, how hard is it? At least none of them died. Because it gets really annoying when they just keep dying. Oh, well, there's one battle for you guys. So, um... Get some dried meat. I've got to sell these later. Um, okay, let's see. What do I have? Raw, coat hide, tattered nomad. 24, 10. I am changing, definitely. Um, ooh. Um, yeah, these people are generally the best to fight first because you mostly mostly have um crappy weapons and armor so some of these might be a bit better um uh, swing 30 31 
might keep that for now, just in case. Anyway, um, I'm gonna take it anyway. Was that hardened? Yeah, I'm taking that one. Um, yeah, at the start, it's best just to take everything. So even the crappy stuff, like rocks, they only sell for one. But, um, you know, it's better to have one more bit of gold in your pocket than none. That's that's how I think of it. That's why I always um grab all the shit I can because really, if one time I might be one gold short. You never know. But um, yeah. Okay. So I gotta upgrade myself. Where is it? There. Huh. Okay. Um, trainer is the best one to get for recruits because you don't have to actually. F they don't actually have to fight, so that reduces reduces the risk of them dying. And um, you know, that's best thing you can do. Um, yeah, and should get some more iron flesh, but I'll get that later. Maybe get some intelligence. Yeah, yeah that's good enough. Um, holy crap, no, bugger off, bugger off, bugger off, yeah. Yeah, if um, you have a big enough force, most enemies won't mess with you, because, you know, if you get 50 men, oh, tournament, perfect. Um, lost my train of thought. Um, yeah, if you have a big enough force, they won't generally, um... You know, mess with you because you have a freaking army behind your back. Parentless. Um, oh yeah, these are heroes. Um, I always have a set hero that I always pick, and he's not one of them, so I won't talk to him. But anyway, um, I don't know. I don't think I can do anything like much now other than sell. I want to join the tournament, but there won't be enough time for that because these can last for like minute, like ten minutes roundabout. So I might only have enough time to um. You know, sell some of the stuff. Now, I don't know if it really matters, but I still do it anyway. I think that um, if you sell weapons at a weaponsmith, you get the same amount of money. Not the same amount of money, but like better price if you sold it um, rather than armor. Like, sorry, let me re-say that. It, you sell weapons at higher prices of when you're at a weaponsmith rather than when you're at a, um, you know, armor or a horse merchant so um yeah I'm not sure if it's true I like to think it is but you know I really don't care <laughs> you know I'll just do the way I think it is um hmm well I have enough time for a quick fight most probably um what am I supposed to do follow these guys or attack them um find a lonely employer blah 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 blah, blah, blah. Okay, I need to follow these guys. So I can't get too close, but then I can't get too far away either. Don't run away from me. So literally just start and stopping. Like, a lot. Oh, 17. C Raiders, see, these are the worst things you can come up against. They are a pain in the ass. Um, I think I might have to kill them. What do you want? Yeah, I have to do it. Four. That should be quick and easy. I'll just let them charge. Probably take them out before they even get there. Um, where are they? Farewell. Uh, yeah, I'll probably get them before um my guys even see them. Um, come on, horse. It's just a slight hill. You can run faster. Um, yeah. So if you guys like this series, I'll obviously do more. Like I said, and um. I think it was a Skyrim one. If you like the videos I'm doing, um, the games I'm doing, sorry, just press the like button and then I know whether to make more of them or, you know, not do as many as I hope I would. Because, you know, they might suck to you guys. Oh god. At least there are only two. And these guys are idiots. They don't know how to block. Oh god. I don't know how to block either. Well, I like block jokes. I do actually, but, you know. Okay, it's getting time. As soon as I kill this guy, I'm gonna have to stop it. Come here! Come here! Bastard. Oh, jeez. He's bobbing and weaving everywhere. Anyway. So, um... Yeah, just read this quickly. Yeah, so we spared him. Just take everything. Which is literally nothing anyway, but um... Okay, so next time we'll go and save the merchant's brother. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Stay tuned.